Uh, it's a different thing traveling Europe with a two-year-old, you know? It's like, I haven't been here in a long time, and, and in my dreams of coming back to Europe, like, oh, you know, I can't wait, I'm gonna go to Paris, I'm gonna go to, like, all the sex shops, and the sex clubs, and, like, Moulin Rouge, you know? It is so hard to convince the bouncer at Moulin Rouge to let you bring a two-year-old in. Uh, really, it's like, come on, man, she's seen it all. She sucks boobs for a living. Uh, like, that's, that's literally her sustenance right now, you know? Boobs have not been to my kid. We both love them. We share an interest. <laughs> you know? It's clearly mine. <laughs> uh, and, 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 and like smart me, I went to Amsterdam on this trip. And, and you know, I'm, not, I'm, I'm in Amsterdam and I'm having fun. I'm walking around with my little girl, you know. But the entire time, I'm just like looking at all the stuff that I can't have. Uh, yeah. and it's just weed, 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 prostitute, weed, weed, weed with prostitute, weed, prostitute smoking weed. Uh, you know, it's like, wow. You know, not that I have that money, so I'm kind of glad that I have this fake excuse. You know? like, I'm not going to be blowing money on, on Dutch prostitutes. You know, that's, that's okay, I would. Uh, that's, that's the whole reason I went there. Like, hey, <laughs> I, I bring my kid to comedy shows a lot. She was here earlier. Uh, she had to leave because uh, she's a sucky heckler. Uh, <laughs> she got kicked out. Uh, but <laughs> I bring her to comedy shows a lot. And, uh, and you know, some comedy shows I go to, they don't let me bring her. They have the, like st strict uh, alcohol licenses. You know, you can't bring a two-year-old in a bar. And I went to this one place. I was out in the Washington area in Seattle. This guy's like, I'm sorry, I can't bring that baby in there. I was like, oh, shit, I've got to perform. Right about then, this homeless dude came up to me and he's like, hey man, you got a dollar? I'm like, dude, I'll give you two if you watch this baby. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what I'm saying is, is there's not enough homeless in Amsterdam. Uh, <laughs> there's a whole market of fathers that could just need like a 10 minute break. Uh, you know what I mean? What am I kidding? Not three minutes. Uh, that's it, three minutes uh, with a Dutch prostitute and a bowl, and I'm good. Uh, you know? uh, 